timing was just completely insane. On Friday night, I got a last minute call from Sutra and saw myself up all the way in Los Angeles driving LMFAO to their nightclub performance at Sutra on Friday night. And then moving to Saturday, we had a bus booked out for the Heaven and Hell Festival at the Del Mar Fairgrounds. A couple last minute things happened. I tried helping out some friends with our bus before we were actually going to pick up our paying customers. And that's where the night just completely got out of hand. Getting ready to go pick up paying customers. <laughs> what was the problem with the last rope? They weren't paying and they encroached on the time and there's a good possibility I'll be late for the next pickup. And I also like to have a 10 minute break so I can pee. You know, okay. unlike a guy, I can't stand up and just whip it out somewhere. You know I had a charter this morning, right? I did a charter this morning. Oh, I thought you just had an air for it. No, I did a, I did a four hour charter. I picked up at 10.45. Hey, at least you're making that paper. Nancy was pretty upset with me after we dropped off that first group, but by the time we got to Coronado, picked up Candace and her friends, everything seemed to be okay. Yeah. Right there. Yeah. No, oh, whoa, no, who do we got here? Troll, we have a troll. Troll, troll, troll. Oh, oh yeah, <laughs> um, We're just gonna get crazy because, you know, this is like the best time of year where all girls can like be and be the film you know? Once we were actually able to get everybody on the bus, then the real party began in the back of it. Now, I wasn't able to see it because I was in the front trying to steer Nancy through Coronado to get her down to Del Mar for the second time. Killing me, Rick. Between you and Drew, I'm gonna have heart failure before the night is over. You know CTR? Vegas calling me the next night for Swedish House Mafia's Masquerade Ball at the Hard Rock Hotel. Drew and I met four years ago in Vegas and we just totally hit it off and now we're best friends and um, I'm one of his most important clients. <laughs> we ended up leaving around Probably around noon from San Diego, and then we went, checked in at Hard Rock, had a wonderful dinner at Nobu in costume, partied at Swedish House Mafia at the joint. Now, if nobody knows what Swedish House Mafia is, it is the three biggest DJs right now coming together and producing some of the best events in the world. Their Mass Grave Ball was truly an amazing production. I mean, you're talking about pyrotechnics, lighting, the sound was just phenomenal, the energy in that place was just, you know, something I had never witnessed before. The night was a success. I was wiped out from a whole weekend of events, but we were able to make it down to San Diego safely. Your LMO company is so damn sexy.